I guess. Uh, today we are going to see uh, the LV panel testing procedure. LV panel testing procedure. So here LV panel means low voltage panel. So we know already low voltage panel the form 1, form 2, form 3 and form 4 panels. So here uh, we are going to see how to test the LV panels. So before that I am giving you some procedure about the LV panel testing. Uh, the first one is we need to make a safety chain around. We need to make the safety chain around the panel. This is a very important. So after that earthing, earthing connection. So earthing connection also important. So we need to make the, the two steps on before we are starting the testing. After that, uh, check the all outgoing and incoming uh, rating of MCCBs and cable rating and bus bar sizes some controls if you have a ELR or shunt trip some tripping relays so any of the whatever you have we need to check as per the drawing so this is the very important things after that we are going to check the continuity so we need to check the continuity face to face and then face to neutral and then face to air after that air to neutral so this is a very important uh, this is also we need to check face to face neutral face to neutral and face to earth and earth to neutral so after this all the procedure completed we need to check the insulation resistance so here insulation resistance we need to check the insulation resistance uh, also face to face the same like that we need to check here that means R Y Y B and the B R so this is a red face to yellow face yellow face to blue face and blue face to red face after that we need to check R face to neutral yellow face to neutral and blue face to neutral after that red face to earth and yellow face to earth and blue face to earth and finally earth to neutral so this is the testing we need to check here this is maximum we need for tigawa sorry minimum we need tigawa or jigawa of ready so this is you have a you got a tigawa or jigawa ready that's for good insulation resistance now we are going to see the real tick of insulation resistance testing just a minute before testing uh, insulation resistance we need to check the working of insulation test tester so here we are connected for two terminals of insulation testers so we are cutter ready for zero so pay though two terminals will be connected to shorter than here so that's why we are cut up before that zero now we are going to check the face yellow and red so here i am only one person so that's why some problem see here so we got for infinite so infinite ready i press that uh, measure button also see here this is the infinite rate see this one is uh, measuring button that means you are connected to measure and plus this one this is the voltage ranges so here uh, regarding the voltage range to the needles readings will be mentioned here so the top one is 1000 ampere and 500 amp 500 voltage and 250 voltage this is measure button they said so this is the way of we are testing the resistance oh. this is measuring button already said lot of time so that's all
the so that's all real tick class insulation distance after that we are going to check high voltage testing so here high voltage testing we need to make us some table so here uh, test voltage after that timing after that testing terminals and then result so here test voltage we have a 2.5 k kilovolt on here timing for 30 seconds the test terminals means red phase to yellow phase yellow phase to blue phase this, this is very important sequence so this is sequence also we need to uh, check here so here we need for minimum uh, 10 gigaohm so this is a very good high voltage resistance so after that we before that i forgot some telling something uh, that means uh, before you doing high voltage testing you need to short current transformers that means current transformer second we need to short here then remove the earth connection of uh, lamp or any of that you have in the pan so that's a very important so that's also we need to remove on here so complete high voltage testing we are going to see now realistically uh, this is a high voltage testing now we are going to do uh, this is a high voltage just a hike so this is for 2.5 kV voltage settled in here so we test for red and yellow phase see here uh, here we sit for 30 seconds so two knobs will be counted for red and yellow faces so readings are going so maybe readings will come for giga ohm after 30 seconds this will be stopped so before that we need to short the cts and then remove the control neutral and other things those are the things so 30 seconds completed we got 131 giga ohm so that's all this is for high voltage so that's all the complete high voltage testing so after the all the testing completed we need to check the functionality testing of panel that means the live voltage testing so live voltage testing means you need to give a three phase supply and check out the output voltage of the mccbs after that we need to check the control some control switch that means clr cbst if you have anything uh, you need to check that function also uh, that's all the lv panel testing procedure if you have any doubts please comment here thank you for watching